disclaimer, okay? I purchased these products with my own money, okay? This is not a sponsored video. I am a makeup enthusiast and I love makeup. So I wanted to reach out and contact this company and I did. And she provided me with a, uh, a, a, a discount code for you guys and no your girl is not making any money off of this discount code Ugh, no that's not how it work y'all it's not that's not how it work uh but the discount code is omo jazz that is o-m-o -O jazz and you get 10 percent off your order so go ahead i'm gonna leave the link down below and the discount code down below and you go ahead and order you some omelo makeup honey because it is Okay, it speaks for itself. Hey everyone, what's up YouTube? How you doing? You good? Me? Look at this face, honey. Look at this face, bae, bae, okay? Can you get into this beat? Uh-huh. Just look at this lip, honey. Mmm. 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 This lip is everything. I tell you, this lip is everything, honey. Yes, Lord, okay? This is... Mm. I was a little skeptical at first because well, when I looked at this color here, I was like, mm, 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 this might, mm, this might not work, honey, this might, this might not work, mm, mm, this might not work, I'm about to go back to my old faithful, but, mm, get into it, mm. I, know, I know you see this, okay, I know you see this, and if you want to know how I got into this face, just continue watching, but I've blown my nose, but this is me now, Okay, get into it. It is, I don't know if you can see that, 423. That's just my babies. All right, but it is 423. I did this face around 8, 30, 45 ish. What's that? 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4. So it's been about 8 hours. And this is what my face is looking like. Now I have dry to normal skin. I don't think I get oily. And I have not had to blot. I'm sorry. Please forgive me for sniffling and whatnot. But I have not had to blot. I haven't had to reapply anything. But I also wasn't going to. Just to see how well this face would hold up. And around my mouth area. Because I've been eating. Uh, some of the lipstick has uh, has uh, moved around a little bit. But it still looks fabulous. It still looks fabulous. Okay. But let's go on and jump right into it. Uh, when I received the package, I got it in this pink wrapping. Of course, all of my mailing information is on the other side. I'm going to open it up. And it comes with this card. And of course, I'm going to read it to you with on the back. Okay. It says, thank you. Your purchase made our day. And we hope this package brightens yours. Beautiful. Amawola. I believe that's how you say it. I'm yeah, I said it right. Amaloa. Amaloa. That's pretty. I'm, I'm, yeah, it's pretty. Amaloa. But okay, the back of it says, we truly appreciate your purchase and support. All our products are created with high quality ingredients and nutrients that are healthy for you. They are long lasting and we hope you enjoy the packaging as well. Thank you for being an amazing customer and have a fantastic and having fantastic taste. <laughs> Amaloa is signed at the bottom. Okay. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, six items. One of the really, really big items didn't come in this bag, but this is the bag that the other items came in. You know, I'm all here for packaging, hunt. Hey, yes, Lord. And it just has Amaloa on here and another website. This is was really cute. Now, I didn't get a full face, but I did get a lot of things. The first thing you're going to see me do is what, y'all? Put foundation on. The foundation, this is the one product. I feel like I'm spitting all over the place. <laughs> get yourself together. But this is the foundation box. Okay. And I'm, I tore the box a little bit trying to open it. Just being extra, okay? And this is the foundation. Isn't this gorgeous? Like, if you don't like gold, I don't know what's wrong with you. Like, who don't like the color gold? But it is everything. Y'all, I gotta sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. This is their foundation. The Pearl Perfect Finishing Foundation. I believe that's the name of it. Pro Perfect Finishing Foundation. The labeling is on the front and there's some labeling on the back. This is the top. Do y'all see that? <laughs> y'all see that, right? 
Yeah, see that, right? Yes, honey. There's a pump on this bottle. This packaging is freaking adorable, okay? Okay, let's go ahead and swatch this for you. Now, when I first got this, I was like, I don't know if this is going to work, but as you can see, it does. All right, we're going to squeeze out a little bit and uh, so I can swatch that for you. Okay. So swatch, I got this in CD30. Hopefully this is coming off true to color. I'm trying to get you some different angles so you can see how, what the color look like. All right, so the, the uh, light isn't washing it out. I'll show y'all, I got it in CD30. Okay, and it was not the, the only darkest shade that they have. This is it on my finger. Let me something to wipe it off. All right, I'm going to read off what the website describes it as, or what the description of it, of it is. It says, Omaloa All Free and Water Based Liquid Foundation provides a smooth, natural, and airbrushed finish. It is infused with vitamins A, C, and E, which helps protect the skin from environmental damage. This lightweight foundation does not cake, but blends effortlessly and gives it the perfect coverage for all skin types. Water based, weightless, flawless finish. It speaks for itself. I can attest that it does all of this. The lightweight, it is very lightweight. I, it doesn't seem like anything is on my face. Uh, it is very buildable. I put one pump and I did one side of my face and I was like, mm, this, I don't, it just gave uh, a clean slate. One one pump will give you like a nice, clean, fresh look. You look awake. Two pumps, I'll be like, all right, she got makeup on. And once you add that third pump, you're going to be, you're going to be slain. Okay, it's going to be flawless. I didn't do three pumps because of how I applied it. I did one side and then I did another side. I did three pumps. Let me correct myself. I did three pumps, but I didn't use all of the third pump because I needed it to be even. Okay. But if I'm doing a whole face and I want to be beat, I will apply a third pump because that, that was amazing. How it, uh, how it just build it to continue to build up on itself. And it gave, I don't know, like, it was just, like, refreshing, because I was very shocked, y'all. <laughs> if you could see my face, by my facial expressions, I was very shocked, because I did not think that that color was going to match. The next thing I got was a concealer. <sighs> y'all, let's, okay. Well, well, let me show you the packaging, okay? It has a sticker. Uh, you might not be able to see this because of the light, but it's, it's a sticker. Now, this packaging is not as bomb as the foundation packaging and I'm pretty sure as they continue to grow then the sticker might go away or I don't know but it's it's just a sticker like it's not like uh, printed onto the packaging like the foundation this is the applicator stick hey y'all this bad boy this bad boy right here is some thick oh that stuff is thick honey I, <laughs> this was like I don't know like <laughs> this is like cream foundation um y'all I, I, I was when I was putting it on my face I was like oh I'm not used to this because my normal found my normal my normal concealer is a liquid concealer and I was like mm, this bad boy right here it's not that easy to blend out Especially not with no beauty blender. You'd be in there like, I was about to be pounding. I felt like I was going to pound a hole in my face, okay? It's not that easy to blend out. It's a nice concealer, but it is not easy to blend out at all. It is very thick. I wouldn't put this on my face and then, you know how certain people put it on it underneath their eyes and then put it on their forehead, on their nose, on their lip, on their chin, and then go back and blend it out? Mm-mm. You can't. Don't let this sit on your face because you would definitely have those lines on your face. Cause I was about, I was scared at first. I, I really was. This is called Cover and Highlight Liquid Concealer. That's the name of this. Cover and Highlight Liquid Concealer. And I'm reading it off of my phone. That's why I keep looking down. Okay. Let's see. The description says our smooth and lightweight formula will last all day. It brightens dark circles, hides fine lines, and minimizes imperfections. Perfect for highlighting under the eyes. Wand applicator allows precise and easy application. I will say that the wand applicator does allow precise and easy application. 
Hmm. Y'all ain't gonna lie. This this not lightweight. This bad boy is is thick. This is like some old cream. This is a cream a cream liquid. Cause it's not cream solid. Like, I don't know y'all like, but this thick, it's a nice concealer, but it is thick. Now, if, if you're not into, I got this in a, what, a WD-11? If you're not into thick concealers, then this this is not gonna be for you. But it, it, it does a wonderful job. It did brighten me up, it did cover up my circles. So it's a nice concealer, but it is thick. I wouldn't, I wouldn't call this bad boy lightweight at all, okay? So, my camera died. And it is late now. When I first came up here, it was what? Four o'clock? It is now... It is now 8.18. You see that? Okay. Your girl was asleep. She took a nap. Okay. The house took a nap. I was tired. So I just woke up. So sorry if I look, look flushed. And whatnot, but we're gonna try to jump right back into this. I'm gonna go ahead and powder this up a little bit. Just wanted to come and show y'all this face, but I did go to sleep, so oh my god, child. That was like ugh. It took me forever to powder my face because I tried to took my contacts out because my eyes started irritating me. I did fall asleep in them. But anyway, let's jump right back into this video. This is her contour sculpt stick. Now, this I got in the color chocolate mousse. Now she did tell me that this was very light it was a very mild contour stick and she she asked me if i was really interested in getting it and uh i was like yeah sure i'll still get it because i don't know i don't know why i didn't listen to her but maybe i should listen to her if she contacted me and was like hey mm, that's gonna be light i'm just wanting i just wanted to inform you that it is going to be a light contour stick it's not like you're about to put black on your cheek and she was right so i didn't even use this it is a cream to powder contour and foundation stick and since it says that it is a foundation stick, I think I'm going to use it as that. I'm going to use this as a foundation stick. Because as you can see, you see, yeah, it's right there. Okay. This would be like a good, maybe summer color for me. Because as you can see, that foundation that was on my hand earlier, it dried. You can't even see where it's at now. It melted so deeply. It melted so well onto my skin. But if you can pick up that contour stick, it's dark, but it is not deep like how I need it to be. So I think I'm going to use this one day as, uh oh. I think I'm going to use this one day as a foundation stick. And that was the color chocolate mousse. It's very creamy. That feels like it's gonna be really, really nice. I'm gonna try that out one day. Since I did not use that, I'm going to briefly show you what I did use. I did use my new uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit, and uh, I love this. Okay, this is a new product. I used what is this? Rich Earth today. Freaking amazing! Just to put that out there. The next thing that I picked up for her from her and I used was the Photogenic Powder. Okay, once again, this is just a sticker on top of the package, and. She's she's fairly new to my to me. She's new, so I'm 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 very confident that this line will grow and it will be in the stores near you. Okay, remember I said that this line will grow and it will be in the store near you. Okay, I got this in the color hazelnut coffee. Hopefully that is picking up. Now these are just stickers, but when she advanced, child, thing will blow. Okay. I came with a mirror. I don't want to blind you. And this is the color here. I think the camera's washing it out. Okay. And not the camera, the light. Okay. There we go. That's it right there. Hopefully you can see that. So. I'm going to put this right underneath here. Can you see that? I don't put that on my knuckle. Oh, child. This powder feels so buttery. I was watching it. It feels so buttery. Okay, so that is the color right there. I might just, it's a lot of powder, so it will look lighter than me. But as you can see, I wore it. I pulled it out. I did it. It's very nice. And once again, that is in hazelnut coffee. And if I'm not mistaken, that is the darkest, that is the darkest shade that she had in her powder. If I'm lying, then I'll put it up there. But I do believe that I got the deepest shade in her uh, face powder. 
Okay, then I went on to do my face, the rest of my face offline. I did. My I got two lippies from her. This lip is still lasting, honey. Mm-hmm. Y'all, like, I'm asleep, but this was a matte lip, so it ain't move. And this thing is still on. So clearly, this lasts all day long. No shade at all. The products that I have used today have been amazing. But if I had to pick my top one, it would definitely be this lip. Followed by that foundation, followed by the powder, followed by the contour and stick, then a concealer. Only because I, I'm not a fan of thick concealers, and that was that was too thick for me. But this lip, y'all, this one right here is in the color Jackie, called Opaque Lip Cream, and this is in Jackie, y'all. This lip is everything to me. Oh my gosh, this thing is everything to me and i thought i was recording all of it but i didn't so i applied my ellery ColourPop uh lip pencil and then i went over it with this oh my gosh y'all i'm just going to do a quick swatch even though you have already seen it i'm gonna do a swatch back here and i'm gonna do it off you can still see me putting it on but i need to see where it's going okay And then the other color that I got that I did not use today is Revamp. And I'm pretty confident that this blood red here, oh, it's going to be freaking gorgeous when I put it on. Freaking gorgeous. Now these are of a liquidier. Is that just making a word? Liquidier. Okay. Those are the two colors right there. The deep purple one is Jackie. And the deep red one is revamp okay they are they stink i ain't gonna lie to y'all they stink but the color goes the smell goes away <laughs> but who honey when i open it i said oh la what is it who child they stink i don't know you know how certain things smell like lipstick this don't smell like lipstick this i don't they stink though i don't I don't know how to tell you that they smell, but don't worry about the smell, okay? Because it's going to vanish later. Just worry about the product, okay, after the smell. Because that smell do start. I ain't gonna lie, okay? This is a very liquid consistency. Can I show you again? Let's see. I'm going go with this. I'm going to go here with it, okay? It's very watery. Like, it's not creamy. I don't know if you can see, like, even the fact that it's so glossy to me. It is very watery, but it dries down to pure deliciousness, okay? Check it. Pure deliciousness, all right? I hope you guys enjoyed this overall tutorial. I'm Awola. Thank you for the discount code that I can give to my friends, my family over here on YouTube, okay? Remember, the discount code is OMO. Amo Jazz, that is O M O J A Z Z. Use that when you purchase your items, and I'm telling y'all, if you don't get nothing else, you need to get these liquid lipsticks, okay? I will leave all of the items that I mentioned down below and all of the products that I have reviewed today. I will leave the link down below so you can check them out. Once again, y'all, go check out these liquid lipsticks. Man, listen, I know that y'all got all types of liquid lipsticks. It ain't gonna hurt you to go and get another one because these are deliciousness, okay? If it's not too much, please feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. Until next time, bye. Thank you, Amaloa.